Hey guys, if you can't already tell, I am in a different space today. I'm not in my usual room, and that's because in this vlog, I'm going to be doing a room tour. So right now, I'm in my friend's friend Megan's room who was featured as the girl underneath the blanket in the last video. I will have her give you a little overview of her room and how she arranged it. Um, and we're in the Covenant Women's Housing. This is Megan's door and it oh, says, oh, shh, there's a 90% chance that Meg is napping. And this is her room. I guess Chris and I just like to be very artsy. <laughs> We're kind of extra, but we Keep like the sign. It's spring. I'm so excited. I wet my plants. This is like our little like art wall thing. We have a K and an M for Kristen and Megan. Yep. We have a mini fridge. We decorated it with what is this stuff? Contact paper. Contact paper. And then you have little shelves that you put food the fridge in. on top of to put your food in. Are the closets good size? The closets I mean are huge. I have all my clothes in my drawers. In here, shall we show them your clothes them. drawer? Oh, so hey. organized. It's piled in there. It actually fits a lot of stuff. And you have a lot of stuff. I do. You have a lot of clothes. I have way too many clothes. These rooms have hooks um, right by the door for your towels because the communal bathrooms. So then you can let these dry right here. And then she has a little mirror in the back of the door. I just wanna preface this and say that there is nobody in this bathroom. We want, I wanted to show you what the bathrooms look like in Covenant because they're different from West. So they are communal, so you got normal stalls. And then over here, there are showers. Well, the showers are pretty decent size. They're actually probably about the same size as the west bathroom but if you're lucky you can get the handicap shower if there's nobody on the floor that is handicapped and it is nice and big also guys look at i stepped up my vlog game and i got this little microphone oh hey <laughs> welcome to my crib she has her bed stacked in a bunk bed so how about you uh do a little explanation of, of what? Of your room. Also, we didn't mention this in the last video, but what do you use to take all of your shower stuff to the bathroom? We use a shower caddy. You, this bad boy makes so. If you're gonna live in Covenant next year, get one of those. And we took the doors off of her closet. Yes, and they're behind our beds. Mm -hmm. And you can use them to. You can do it. You can either choose to take them off or keep them on, whatever you want to do. Yeah, we use them to hang lights. Those lights burned out. That's okay. And then I used it to hang some pictures of some friends from back home. Then this is my corner. I have my record player, because I'm a sucker for vinyl, as you can tell. All this wow. good stuff. Grandma at heart. I am a grandma. <laughs> I go to bed at like 10 o'clock at night. <laughs> I have my coffee maker. I can't survive without this. I mean, I can, but it's just harder. All right, that is it for Jamie's room. Say bye. <laughs> so now I thought I would show you my side, um, not my side, my room. You've seen it in the background just a little bit, but I thought I would just give you a little bit more details of how I arranged my room. So over here I have my fridge and some of my plants. I have a little box of candy or bowl, jar, <laughs> jar of candy. And then I have some utensils right here, a pizza cutter because um, you need pizza in your life. And then all my beautiful plants that have been mentioned in every single video so far. I've got some pictures right here, my futon, and then my ladder goes up there to my bed, which isn't made, so I'm sorry about that. We've got my dresser, so this has all my clothes in it. Way more organized than Megan's drawers. We got my little calendar, some books for class, some lotion, some this makeup mirror, more books. And then I have my closet, which is actually quite large. It's very nice. I keep some shoes up there and random stuff. And then my hamper down here. Since there are only two of us in this room, I get this whole thing for myself, which is amazing. And I have more shoes over here. And then I keep like sweatshirts and coats and stuff on that side. This is something that's unique to West is that we get our own bathrooms and I think it's super nice and I love cleaning 
so it's not a big deal to me because this bathroom usually stays pretty clean. I have my toothbrush in a little jar right here that says Olivia and then we each get four drawers and then the underneath compartment where we have our garbage can so that is the end of the women's room tours men if you're watching if you really want a room tour of the men's dorm halls I can do that for you just let me know sure shoot Dort an email or write it in the comments and yeah I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time bye guys